then there was the chocolate that used to help you. Oh, sorry. Hello. We're just talking all about chocolate here. We're very excited to be with you tonight. This is the second live hour of your one day special. My word. I'm going to tell you something now, which is quite astonishing, really. The one day special sold out in less than six minutes today. That's pretty good going i think um now with your one day special it is back on extended delivery when i say extended delivery it's only monday it kind of makes sense really because we're heading towards the end of the week anyway so this will be dispatched on monday for you but you need to start checking out your baskets because we are already busy once again the value of this is absolutely phenomenal we are approaching half the stock of the one day special gone already i want to introduce you to the lovely k from indigo blue hello hi everybody my <laughs> word what a whirlwind i know how I know. amazing it was just fantastic thank you so much everyone and this is the second magazine of mixed media it, it that is. we've had from indigo it blue is. shall we just talk about mixed media for a moment mm -hmm. um because i love i've come into the world of mixed media and i absolutely love it but there might be some people out there that might think it's a specialist craft when it's not it's not everybody out there has got the skills already so you're already making cars you're already doing mixed media you just don't realize it it's just a, a way of bringing together different items so it might be that you're using stamps and inks but then you might want to use a bit of paint or some luscious or some texture paste and that's bringing all those separate elements together in one project so you're probably already doing that it's just that we extend it and we do things like art journals we do canvases we do uh, home decor art and all those other gorgeous things and it doesn't have to be all brown and grungy either so you know forget all of that um, and it's really really quite simple step-by-step -step instructions in this magazine it's just fantastic it certainly is you're getting 65 projects in that magazine but it's not just the magazine you're getting and this is hot off the press world lunch hit wor world world law i'm still thinking about that chocolate for me mixed media is just a paintbrush and a bar of chocolate but anyway <laughs> anyway uh, 65 projects in the magazine but is it 69 69 69 projects in the magazine i stand corrected but it's more than that it's so much more than that 17 pounds and 97 pence saving three pounds on that price you are getting your stamps those beautiful stamps on your a4 set of stamps you've got the stencil on there you've got your various different images that you can use separately you've got your embossing folder as well which is going to look absolutely beautiful and stunning all year round you've got your die there the moth just at the bottom so you can use that on different projects as well and then you've got your two stamps your red rubber stamps that are exclusive to this magazine deal right there so you won't and be able they, to buy those and you won't be able to buy them anywhere so exclusive mm -hmm. with the magazine and so it's definitely worth going for just to get those two stamps right there 731572 is your item number we're already busy over half the stock has gone dispatching on monday now can we talk about the larger extended bundle that we've got my my now everything we've just spoken about right there your one day special but then we've got even more for you so let's talk about that starting with these magnificent stamps here the artwork in here is absolutely amazing i love these aren't Th they cool? these are absolutely gorgeous and these are actually designed by janine gerard shaw who is a, a designer of ours that we've collaborated with and her designs are superb they are so detailed so beautiful I just adore them and when you are colouring them, if you choose to colour them, you see more and more coming through, you know, you'll discover a little um, area like a little fish coming out here or a little starfish or something, it's just magical and I really, really love them Look and at the, that. the design team have loved them as well. We love I mean, them so much we actually put them on the fabric as well. Yeah, I mean this is incredible, not only are you getting the stamps, that beautiful turtle, you're also getting the seahorse as well, you've got those sentiments in there, but you're also getting the fabric. Now you can cut into this, you can colour this, you can put it onto bags, on t-shirts, on jackets, pencil cases, you can do exactly what you want to do with this. Even actually you could embellish some curtains or quilts or pillowcases. 
um, absolutely stunning and again you can use your fabric paints within this as well so with your extended you have your luscious powders now they are going to come to you in a set of three and they're going to be different colors so it's a lucky dip now tell us about the luscious powders I've seen them in action but let's tell everyone at home how gorgeous these are um, these are so popular everybody loves them and um, they are um basically a ground up pigment so the pigment is the color so that's what you find in your paints in uh, in dyes uh, how we dye our clothes our makeup all sorts of things that's what pigment is but this is a an artist quality pigment ground up we've also put mica in there and that's what gives you that gorgeous shimmer and then we've put what um, what we call a binder in and that's what makes it stick to a surface so you can paint it onto lots of different things so it's a powder but that means that you can use it in lots of different ways so you can mix it in with your clay you can mix it in with your texture paste your texture gel sorry you can actually add water to it and use it as a paint so there's loads of different ways you can use it and that's why we love it so much because it's it's one part of magic that can do so many tricks you're absolutely going to adore this and there's something extra special as well with the one day special when you buy the one day special what we go well what what we we're the royal we now uh, <laughs> what Kay and the team are going to do is going to put samples in certain packages that are going out so just like Charlie and the chocolate factory in the golden ticket you might find something extra special inside the one day special package that you're getting so, so those, those are all that I'm making over the next two days yes yes, yes. Well, will the stock be here over the next day or so? Oh, my word, I don't know. Now, half the stock of that larger bundle, the payments of £29.97, it makes it affordable and it gets you extra. It gets you extra. 624737 is your item number. Place those into your basket and really enjoy making and creating. Right, we're heading to Kay now to have a look at the magazine so you can see what's available inside Kay. Thank you. Um, it, I'm so thrilled with this. I only saw this afternoon when I arrived. Obviously I'd seen a lot of the projects that the girls had made but it's just so stunning. Really, really pleased with it. Julia's, um, Julia Watts has got the front cover here um, and there's a gorgeous, gorgeous 3D model on the front which we've got live in studio here. And then I'm just going to flick through some of um, some of these pages and then you can see how many projects you've got. Look at all this in here. Absolutely stunning. So um, it's all full of techniques. It's all full of exactly what you've got in the pack as well. And then we go on to the design team for practical publishing have done projects. This is Vanessa Hodgson. Thank you, Vanessa. Beautiful work. Um, we've also got all of the Indigo Bluebells, the our design team that have done projects as well. So you'll see all of theirs featured. Nikki Gilbert, thank you very much. Um, then we've got Sarah Gray as well. She's one of the practical publishing team. Um, she's got a colourway of blues and greens. I think this is interesting. Uh, Lisa Robson has actually done a focus on the dye. And it's really interesting how you will discover really nice techniques in this uh, magazine as well. So we've got these gorgeous home decor pieces by Sue Ralph. Absolutely love these. Um, this one didn't come back to us though. I think someone at Practical Publishing has got that on their desk. Really? I think <laughs> they might have. <laughs> <laughs> it's gorgeous, isn't it? So all step-by-step -step instructions. There's also going to be um, a, a recipe for you here of all the ingredients that you're going to need, all the materials um, of what's actually been used, and then really good instructions of your step-by-steps as well. Um, and then we've even got some... Um, uh, uh, scrapbooking here as well by Helen Griffin so she's actually used the A4 sheets in the f uh, full piece and done some nice um, scrapbooking of her family and then we've got Ingrid uh, Vichova she's actually done a focus on the embossing folder so you can see what lovely detail you get from this embossing folder as well and how those work so well now we've got a change here we've got Julie Atkinson who's come with some of the latest additions to the indigo blue uh, stock of stamps and products and she's actually showcased some of these really beautifully so you might actually have some of these stamps already that have been featured recently on new releases for Hachanda and then we come to the papers now these papers 
these are a different paper to what the magazine is actually made out of so this is on a, a matte base it's nice um, it's a nice weight but I don't like them too thick that when you do layering it, it's too chunky so it absorbs the slap it on really well and I love the way that the design team have taken our images and actually created fantastic backgrounds and uh, individual elements which I've used a lot actually and these are the sort of uh, backgrounds that I would actually normally do with uh, with paint with luscious with stamping but they've already done it for you so if you are just beginning and you want to dip your toe into mixed media this is the perfect way because you can actually just use these papers as your background and then just cut and layer on and it will be so easy just to um, do some lovely projects with this whether it's to make a journal also you know these are the perfect size the A4 to fold over and do an A5 journal as well so um, really really good place to start if you wanted to have a go at journaling and you'll notice now that we're repeating so they're double sided so you get a chance to use both sides because they are a repeated pattern and you can see that the quality is really, really lovely. And then we come on to some more makes. Um, so this is Carolyn Lakin, a uh, beautiful work. She's got 3D page. She's got a uh, lovely uh, traveler's um, art journal page. Um, really nice in sepia her focus was on the stencil so that's the great thing about the magazine as well we are focusing on different elements of your um free um well free i mean they're ridiculous aren't they the price of them uh, the whole bundle so um you will see people using the stencil or you'll see them using just the dye or the papers or with me i've just concentrated on techniques so i've gone through flit glue techniques background techniques layering uh, doing specialist techniques so i'm going to be doing some of those um tonight and tomorrow as well uh, joe rice has got lovely um colorway here some gorgeous stuff and then we've come on to Penny Jill Cripps please excuse me if I've not said that right Penny Alfie did correct me the other day um, so she's got some gorgeous work here I mean look there's just, it's just it goes on and on and on doesn't it's it full it's full of fantastic. inspiration full of techniques as well and the great thing is you can sit down in the comfort of your own home yes you can watch shows again you can watch K these shows will be available for 60 days but it's nice to have the magazine there I don't know about you sometimes when I put together a te technique and I do a piece of artwork and I put it to one side and I go oh that's fantastic then a couple of weeks later, maybe a month later, I think, oh, I'll do that again. And I think, oh, I've forgotten how to do that. And what's lovely is that you've got this reference with you at all times. That you can just pick up in your own time and then sit down and craft by yourself or with your friends and family. Oh, it's just it's just brilliant. It's just superb. I absolutely love it. So proud of it. Really am. Yeah, you um, certainly should be. You really, certainly really should chuffed. Be. Uh, we are extremely busy, everyone. Just to show you one of the projects, actually, out of the book. You can see it here, uh, but then if I pop that to the side of it, this is something you'll be making and creating at home because you will have the papers to do so and other elements that might be around your crafting room. Here's another one with that balloon down the bottom again. How gorgeous is that? This could be a card for somebody. How about putting that onto a plaque onto the wall? Uh, a spare part of your home, maybe you've got a wall and you're thinking, what can I put on there? Put this onto a plaque, maybe into a frame, and put it onto the wall. And it's something you've created under the guidance of Indigo Blue and the designers in here. It's a fantastic magazine, it really is. But it's not just the magazine you're getting, of course. You've got the papers inside and you're getting the stamps, the stencil, you're getting a die included. So this is like a Christmas time when you get a toy, you're getting the batteries and everything you need to get making, to get creating and start enjoying your mixed media projects. Very busy though, £17.97. I'm going to show you some more samples uh, of the different projects that you can create using the designs in the book. I mean, that is fantastic. What a great card for your dad or your brother or somebody that's just interested in travelling, interested in steam trains, for example. We've got Discover, Explore and Dream, a lovely theme that's going on there with that balloon. And it's a gorgeous design. And with that red rubber as well, you're going to get all of that fine art detail that's in there. So whether you're adding colour to this with your luscious uh, powders or 
or whether you're just leaving this as black and white or going for a vintage look it's going to look absolutely fantastic each and every time beautiful colors as well using that moth um dye that's in there Just totally forgot the word um but the reason why i forgot is because that, that's fantastic so is that out of a die cut paper and then die cutting on top of that um, or is that I the detail of the the, the moth Yes, that's the detail of the dye. Wow. It's fantastic, isn't it? It's that's really incredible. Good. You know, seeing the dye just at fr in, in the front of me there, I didn't realise it cut out that beautiful detail. Oh, that is inc that's stunning. It's Abs nice, isn't yes, it? Yes, that yeah, really is. It's lovely. And it looks nice in the different colours as well. You've got one in the orange, one in the pink, and one in the black just there. Oh, that dye is Fabulous, I love that. Uh, each and every time that you create something and design a new piece of artwork, I'm calling them, them, them artwork because it is. Even if it, you're just giving this as a card, it's a piece of artwork. How stunning is that? If you want to get hold of your one day special, 731572 is your item number, £17.97. Don't forget we've got that larger bundle as well. Details for that at the bottom of the screen. That's divisible into two payments. So £17.97, that's for your one day special. But because you've got your flexi payments on your larger collection, for £10 more or thereabouts for your first payment, just less than that, you're getting all the elements in your one day special, the papers, the stamps, the stencils, um, those exclusive stamps to you here you can't buy anywhere else. Then you're getting these fabulous stamps that were only launched, I believe, last week only launched last week so you've got the sea turtle there you've got the seahorse as well absolutely stunning images there let me just drop in a piece of artwork by emma blake isn't that stunning and then you've got your fabric right here with all those gorgeous different images on um, something like that cut around it color it in use that as an embellishment on your projects which is absolutely a fantastic idea from anything from a tote bag to a jacket to a quilt maybe even to use to color in and then cover up your books your journals and things like that um, so that's your larger um, bundle and you're also getting a selection of three luscious powders pigments um, absolutely sensational now if you want to go for both if you want the one day special and you want to go for the larger bundle as well. I know you're getting the magazine twice in that deal, but the great thing is you've then got a gift for somebody, haven't you? You can keep one for yourself. You could split up all the different items and you've got a whole host of different Christmas presents. We do need to be careful with money at the moment. So that would be an ideal opportunity to get the one day special, give the magazine away, you could give the stamps away if you want to, or you could just have some to keep and cherish yourself. So if you do want to go for both, then they'll both be divisible into two. Right, let's head back to Kay and have some demonstrations. Any questions, by the way, do email in. It's studio at hochanda.com. Right, Kay, what we're going to have a look at? Oh, so I thought I'd do you um, a piece for a journal page, or it could be made into a card, whichever you prefer. So I'm starting off with a piece of um, paper out of the paper pack. Um, and this, again, is lovely, this background. Uh, it's this sort of thing that I would make. And so I'm going to use this stencil. Now, we've had an email from Anne, and Anne wants to know if there's anywhere she can get hold of the <coughs> first copy of the magazine. She's very new to mixed media, but absolutely loves it. That's great news, Anne. Oh, um, is there anywhere welcome. she can get that? Lovely, Anne. Um, unfortunately not, because we just sold out of every last copy um, on her chanda last time. And we even, um, I think we had one that we were going to keep just for archival purposes at Indigo Blue. We literally sold all of them. So I'm so sorry, because once it's, it's published, um, there's no reprinting of them at all. So right. I am sorry about that. But at least you've got this one, so you can get cracking on this. So um, welcome to Mixed Media. You'll love it. That's actually a good point and good to know. It's a good idea if you do want this not to wait. Pop it into your basket, check on out, make sure you get it. And with that news about when it's gone, it's gone, why don't you go for two or three? I mean, I, I don't really... I feel awful saying three. that because, well, I'm, <laughs> well, you might want one for yourself, one for your family, one for your friends. I feel awful saying that because I know how busy we are with people trying to get hold of one, let alone yeah. three. Um, but, you know, just an idea. Just I must say, just it, is, saying. it is actually really, really nice present. 
Yes. And it's a ridiculous price for everything that you get. But if you're, you've got a crafty friend or who wants to get into this sort of thing, it is perfect, actually, um, because, as you said, it's, it's sort of everything is in there to have a have a go at and the the projects range from you know absolute beginner to more challenging and more intricate not that they're difficult they're just more uh, spend more time on them and um, so what I'm doing here while I'm chatting away is I've actually got some slap it on super thick which is a gel medium that we use we're using this for stenciling at the moment but it is a really good strong glue as well and we use it for textures and lots of different things and it does dry clear and then I'm mixing it with a tiny bit of Poseidon Blue Luscious so you can see we get a huge jar of Luscious um, for the price it's really really good don't ask me the price that's Janet's job <laughs> I don't know what the price is pounds and 97 pence Thank and you, you get three of those 25 mil in each one seven four nine seven six seven is your item number definitely worth going for you've got some great color combinations here uh, pink orange pineapple you've got September uh, sorry steampunk lilac uh, porcelain you've got uh, blue in there as well absolutely stunning results with these uh, lavender raspberry coral they are gorgeous together absolutely check all of these out on the website you've got peacock buttercup and cheeky peach Ooh, mm. cheeky pitch. Was that Poseidon Blue that you were using there? Kate? It was. It was Poseidon Blue, yes. That comes with Olive Grove and Mermaid's Tail. You've also got Unicorn Dreams, um, Parma Violet, not Parma Ham, Janice, Parma Violet. No, not Parma uh, Ham. <laughs> Pen Penny Dreadful, but that is, a, that is an incredible colour. Go and see them all on the website. Oh, Emily, our producer, her favourite is Fizzy Pop. What does Fizzy Pop come with? <laughs> La lime that spritzer with and lime lemon sherbet. Ah, it comes with lime spritzer and lemon sherbet. Perfect. So I've, um, I've just stenciled a little bit on here, but I have some left over and, you know, typical crafter, I can't possibly waste it. So um, I've actually just grabbed another piece of um, watercolour card and just put it onto there so I can make something else later on out of it and wash your stencil straight away because this actually is an acrylic medium so it does dry fairly quick and you don't want it clogging up your your nice new stencil so there we go that's all nice and clean and I'm just going to put that off to one side to dry it won't won't take long to dry let me put that there okay and then I'm going to get a piece, another piece of the same page and I'm going to use a stamping platform. I love it. <laughs> yes, they're just saying in my ear, is it on the right side? I was trying earlier on desperately to stamp something and it wasn't working and I felt a right fool. I'm thinking, this is ridiculous. I actually own a stamp company and <laughs> I can't stamp. And it's because on this one you have rubber on one side and clear on the other and I had it on the wrong side because <laughs> I'm used to using rubber stamps you see oh. so <laughs> is it on the right side now Kay? Uh yes good we'll yes, soon find out <laughs> I feel such an idiot no don't don't we all do it so what I'm going to do is I'm going to stamp and heat emboss so I'm using um, Versafine but you can use any slow drying ink this actually isn't terribly slow well it's, it's fairly slow oops don't get it wrong this time Kay and then press down but the good thing is if you haven't inked it up right you can always do it again like that <laughs> I'll just move that out of the well, way well do you know mixed media is all about not not I always know. being perfect that's true <coughs> and I'm certainly not perfect. <laughs> um, now, you can use these on stamping platforms, but you can also use them with um, stamping mounts as well, can't you? The clear oh, yeah, stamps. Absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. Um, and then I'm going to um, put some clear embossing powder over this. Give that a. And it sticks to the image, you see, the wet ink. It will stick to that. Um, I use lots of um, recycled paper for my work, so Do excuse you? what's on the back. There's nothing, nothing um, you know, that needs to be kept secret or anything like that. No, no secret formulas or anything. My, that's a blue gun and a half. Wow. <laughs> oh, Where did that you come jealous? from? <laughs> 
Just a little bit. It's, it's, it's good that I didn't get that out while Adam was here. Mike, have, have you just done all of that in... That about, is, right, in, I want one of those glue... Not glue guns, I want one of those not, heat guns. It's not... It's, That's amazing. I wouldn't, I wouldn't recommend it, really, because... It's not it's a paint actually stripper. It's stripping paint right. off a door. I thought it And I be. actually got the idea because I was, you know, stripping paint. Yeah. And I thought, wow, this is great as a heat gun. I thought I'd try it. You know, wow, and as I say, it does it in like two seconds. <laughs> I'm impressed with that. <laughs> Sometimes a bit too hot, actually. Let me just check. Let me just check. Yeah, there we go. See, so it is quite dangerous. So I wouldn't recommend you go out and buy the one fastest of those. embosser in the West. But this, this is why I got it actually, to be perfectly honest. I got it because I thought that's brilliant for demonstrations because there's nothing worse than waiting for someone to actually heat dry something, is there? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to have a lovely play now. Now, I like what so you've done with your luscious powders there. Put them so into that little tray. Yeah, so I've got um, a little tray. This is... Um, unfortunately, we don't have them on Hachanda. Uh, we couldn't get hold of them um, because they're from... Um, what's the company called? Ranger. Um, but we are allowed to say that they are available on our Indigo Blues website. Yes. Um, thank you very much for that plug. That's <laughs> all right. But yes, um, if you've got any little uh, palettes, or even if you've just got an old plate, when you actually mix up um, these into making a watercolour, um, the good thing is that because they're mixed just with water, you can reconstitute them. If you mixed it with, you know, the slap it on, obviously you can't because that's an acrylic base. But because we're actually using water, we're making a little paint and then it will just carry on being reconstituted very, very easily. So the reason um, I'm using this palette, um, I actually like putting all the labels on so I know what I've got in here so I don't forget. But the way to mix it is to take your brush, which is wet, and dip it in the powder, just like that, to pick up the, uh, the powder. There we go. And then put it in your palette and just mix it up. It's a bit, it's a little bit like mixing flour and, and egg. You need to just give it a little mix for a bit. There we go. And I like the consistency of maybe single cream. Yeah, that's a good, which is, good analogy. Which is quite, quite good. And then I'm going to come in here and I'm going to start painting. Now, the reason why I used embossing powder is that because I'm not a very accurate painter, it will resist the areas of embossing. So you can just paint away and you can see that the black lines are not getting covered over. Because if you didn't emboss and you just use normal um, ink because of the pigment because they're so pigment rich and they've got the mica in they will actually cover up the black lines which i don't want so this color here see how i'm reconstituting it is cherry lips which is this one and i love this one because it's it, again it's another duo tone and this has actually got blue in it oh my goodness yeah i can see that so it will shine pink and blue could so I, K, if I wanted to, sprinkle that on paper and then spray it with um, a mister? Yes, you could, but it won't act like um, brushes. No. Um, because but they're a different, it different would give product. a different effect. It would give mm. a different effect, but yes, you can. And also, I have actually sprayed it, sprayed um, onto the watercolour card, the pink frog one, and, um, and then I've tapped it on and let it just disperse in the water. Oh, now so that, that's that would quite be nice, good. actually. We've got some of that pink uh, Frog Crafts card, watercolour card, on the show. We've got A5 and A6. There's 200 sheets in total. It's excellent value for money. Uh, you get 100 of each, and it's £19.99. and pence. I've got some of this at home, and I absolutely adore it. So um, if you do like colouring, if uh, watercolouring, for example, it's always beneficial to have the right card, and trust me, this really is. 19 811166 you get a hundred of the a5 and a hundred of the a6 as well which is a perfect size for experimenting and doing flowers on i must admit i do like the pink frog i'm using a lot of it because it's such a brilliant price you don't have to worry about being 
too precious over it. Yeah, true. Um, I mean, we, we do some lovely cotton papers, but I think sometimes people get a little bit too precious over it. Mm. And this is, um, you know, this is great to use for all sorts of, and it's smooth enough actually for stamping. Is so, it? So you get the watercolour effect, but you can also stamp onto it, which is really good. And then of course you've got your super smooth and they do a black as well. Yeah, now the really super good. smooth, is that, you can still add your uh, luscious? You can, as long as you don't wet it too much. Yeah. But this luscious isn't, isn't that wet. Yeah. You know, it's not like sloshing lots of layers on like we do. Um, but it will always um, flatten out anyway. So I think I might just um, use a bit of cheeky peach. Is it cheeky peach, this one? Cheeky no, peach. No, it, it's coral. I do beg your pardon. Oh, is it? This one's coral. This is such a lovely um, peachy, apricotty colour. It's gorgeous. You look like you've got a luscious one. top on, actually, with all the colours. Oh, yeah. Alfie you did luscious, say, yeah. I'll stand out in this. I said, should I wear <laughs> this top? He went, yeah, you'll stand out. <laughs> It's fabulous. <laughs> so I'm just, I've just changed my mind because I got a bit carried away because I was talking. I've just changed my mind and thought, actually, no, I, I want some um, of the cheeky, cheeky bit of coral here. Not the cheeky peach, the cheeky coral. Um, so I'm just painting over the top a little bit, which you can because you can reconstitute these whilst they're actually on your uh, painting. So you can go back in and you can re-wet it and rework it, which is the great thing about when you add water to them. So I'm gonna come in with some um, mermaid's tail, which is a lovely sort of green, but what we've done is we've actually put quite a nice sparkle into it, and also, let me just, there we go. I've actually put, asked, well, I haven't personally, but <laughs> we, we wanted gold in it as well, so it would sparkle like like a mermaid's tail funnily enough because you do know that mermaids are real you know absolutely of course. absolutely i dated one for years <laughs> 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 she never came out of the water so i don't know whether she was or not you couldn't you couldn't take her out very often could you no. <laughs> only when it was raining <laughs> yeah and then she'd flap around a bit wouldn't she yeah. <laughs> always felt guilty when i got in the taxi bye yeah. <laughs> No mermaid was harmed in that story, by the yes. way, before anyone emails in. <laughs> right, so this is the lovely mermaid's tail here. So this is, that's exactly how you do it. Okay, nice and sort of quite thick and creamy. You don't want it really runny, because then you're not going to actually really see the colour. And this is when the embossing comes into its own, because you can just do a splodge over it and then it will just resist those areas that you don't want. I'm just going to put a little bit over this pattern here as well. So you can see that it pulls away from there quite nicely. And because I've got it on a patterned background as well, I'm not going to need to actually do too much to this at all. I can just enjoy having a little bit of a a play with my colouring here and then I think I might just um should we do a bit of a blue rose as well so what should we go for oh what's this down here now this what kind of mediums can we use the luscious on Kay right so it just depends what you mix it with so because it's a powder I mean you can even mix it with clear varnish and put it on your nails I mean can you you can oh actually my. yeah I have done that um so it just depends what you mix it with. It's great with um, uh, air dry clay. You can mix it with, uh, you know, um, when you're doing molding, molds, yeah. and you normally put um, corn flour in the mold. Yeah. Well, if you dust a little bit of luscious on, it will pick that up um, as and, well. And dry in the air dry clay. And dry Ooh. in the air dry clay. You can mix it with, um, Resin, it looks amazing with resin. I have hot done glue? a couple of um, hot glue, perfect. Oh my yeah. word, we've got a hot glue gun on the one day special actually. Oh, have you? Um, sorry, on the seven, what did I just say? Sorry, no, we've not got it on the one day special. Seven day saver. Seven day saver. Um, on the website, because I've always fancied getting a hot glue gun. Now, knowing that I can use the luscious with those, that yeah, would be amazing. Absolutely. 
Yeah, that's why I did them in a powder form because um, I wanted to teach people how to use the, the bare essentials of the ingredients that we use to make the products with. You know, so instead of um, having, you know, 10 different products, you've got something that will be versatile. And that's, that's the learning curve of it because people will have bought some of these and they'll go, actually, I've never thought of using it with resin. Um, and they, they've decided they're going to have a go with it and it's just brilliant. It looks like opals. Beautiful. When you put it in, it just looks like opals. It looks fantastic. Well, I've just been counting there. So you've got one product that will do your hot glue guns, your air drying clay. It will also work with your resin. It will work with your watercolours. You could pop that onto the paper and spray onto it and get a certain effect. So we've got five different ways mm -hmm. of using them just there. I've and that's not five different projects, is it? No, no. I've uh, mixed it in with embossing powder as well to give you a sort of clear embossing powder with an opaly sort of look to it. That looks Ooh. fantastic. We've also got um, uh, magic uh, sparkles as well. So that will add extra sparkle to anything you're working on as well. So there's just so much you can do with it. You can add it to anything that's um, a gel medium. So that's slap it on thick, slap it on matte, fabric sparkles, anything like that um, you can colour because once you mix it with a, a fabric base yeah you can actually um, use it on fabric I've actually used it with our uh, translucent paints because of course the translucence of the paint um, won't overshadow the wow. luscious so you can actually make sparkle paints with it as well and there's a, so there's a lot in those pots of your luscious there is there is indeed. Um, that's why I wanted, you know, normally you'd be paying about five pounds for a five mil, which is about the size of the lid. Yeah. Um, but we wanted to make it so it's affordable, um, which is, you know, our philosophy anyway. We wanted affordable craft products yes. that are of a, uh, a quality, an artist quality, because, um, I mean, the products have really come up in, in quality in recent years but a few years ago you know if you bought craft quality it would be rubbish yeah you know or another word beginning with c <laughs> you know <laughs> crafting sorry <laughs> but it would be rubbish and then and you'd be paying through the nose for something that was manufactured for like 10p yes, yes. so um so yeah it's nice to actually use really nice quality products and and the people that we work with on this um, they always say it's really nice to work with us because we never talk about I need it to be this price we yeah. always talk about I want it to do this 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 and this you talk about the quality of the product That's right first. and yes. then they can actually you can get nice quality stuff and they enjoy actually doing that with us um, you know so we get we get really nice products that I want to use and hopefully other people yeah, will. Yeah, of course, absolutely. So what I'm going to do here is just put a little bit of colour. So these are the uh, stamps that you're getting in your one day special. Now you can't get these anywhere else other than your one day special so they are very special um, and you're also getting those included in the larger bundle as well. Details for that at the bottom of your screen. So it's really nice actually to have something that is exclusive to the magazine. And I love these. They're just fantastic. I uh, really, really enjoy using these stamps. Um, and I don't know whether you can see, but there is actually writing on those through those checks. So you don't get a solid colour. You, it is broken up slightly as well. Ooh. So I think I might just do that. I, I do need to tell everyone at home, 60%, nearly 60% of the extended stock of the One Day Special. When I say extended, it's only Monday that they're being sent out, so that's absolutely fine. Uh, but si nearly 60% of the stock has gone. We sold out in around about six minutes in the first show. I'm not sure 
how much is going to be left by the 8 o'clock show tomorrow morning because we do have overnight repeats and people do go and watch the shows again on Rewind. They're available. People come in from work, from shift patterns uh, in the United States, in Europe as well. They tune in at different times. So they're watching at different times to you. And if there's any stock left, then they'll be buying it. So it's an idea. If you want it, £17.97 is a superb price. Pop it into your basket and you can multi-buy if you want to. <laughs> yes, it is allowed. <laughs> right, so I'm just going to start putting this together now. So what I want is I want layers. So this is fantastic. This is uh, part of the papers. So you'll find lots and lots of little elements. Um, do you know, why, why, why did I bring three and all three are empty? I might have to ask Ben to go and get me some uh, liquid glue. Have you got any liquid glue? You know, P PVA? Anything like that. Ben's Thank onto you, Ben. It. He's such a love. He really is. He is. If anyone can so find you some glue, Ben can. He can, can't he? So I'm going to go with this about there. Oh, bless. Can you hear him running in the background? He's, you, a, super, you he's a superhero. He is a superhero. He's really lovely. But we won't yeah, let don't him fall over, no, Ben. Don't will fall you, over, love? Ben. And we, and we don't even have a telephone box here for him to go in and change his costume <laughs> and come out the other side just wearing his pants and a cape. I thought, I thought he wears that anyway. Well, he did, that's how he turns up to work, um, in his superhero outfit, which we love. We do love. So I'll just keep on checking where this is going to go. OK, I think that's OK there. How are you doing, Ben? Um, tacky glue all right for yeah. you? Yeah. Tacky by name, not nature, by the yeah. way. I'm surprised you haven't got any of Phil's lying around. Phil normally has it. Oh, bless you. Thank you so much. That's superb. Oh, it's a fresh one. <gasps> oh, it's a fresh one. Thanks, Ben. He's such a love. Oh, that's brilliant. Did you say I can keep you it? You can keep that, <gasps> yes. Oh, present. Thanks. <laughs> Inty good. He is hey? good. He's Inty a love. good. He is a love. Yeah, he will be paying for it, don't worry. <laughs> yeah, you know, just don't, make that, ear, don't like let me feel bad wages. over that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> don't do that to him. Right, what else have we got? Um, I think, um, yeah, let's go for a bit of, uh, bit of lace. Nice bit of lace. Oh, you know, I should have got this red stuff off before, and shouldn't I, because this is going to take me forever. What is it, double-sided tape? Yeah. I'm going to throw that there okay. and see whether you can yeah, get that tape give off me something me. to do. I like right. that. Yeah, that's going to go there. Let me just I get my glasses think. on. That's the <laughs> she's <laughs> literally she's under underneath the counter yeah, getting was, a go bag. That was me unzipping my bag, not yeah. my trousers. <laughs> 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 just in case you were wondering, I can't find my glasses. I'll just take she it. She can't off. find the glasses. I'm she's all, not going to be able to do it now. I'm, are I, you, love? I'm, no, I will. I'll do it because. I never give up, Kay. This is one thing I don't do. I never give up. Stickability is a secret of success. And there you go, I've done it. It is. Wow, that was quick. It certainly was. Good job I asked you to do didn't it. Didn't even need your pokey tool to do it. Did it without a pokey. <laughs> do you know what was really funny? She's actually taken the tape right off. <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> <laughs> it's stuck to her fingers. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah. oh. Oh, wow. Well, no, now you can right. use your tacky I glue. I can use my tacky glue now. <laughs> that I was can. my thought. Well, that was my thought behind it. I thought, that you know. That is superb. That is superb. I, I thought, oh, that. Ben's going to go you some tacky glue. Let's use it. Yeah. That's excellent. Love <laughs> it. Love it. I think it worked better. <laughs> you know how you've got that pokey tool? Do you want it back? Yes, please. Let me just sanitise it. She's going to throw it. it, but, you know, we're going to be safe. I will there we go. gently Thank hand you so that much. over. Thank you. <laughs> over the trap door. Can't believe it. I thought it came off easy. <laughs> That's hilarious. I think I need to give you a project, don't I? Because you, you're really into this um, yeah, nice media now. Yeah, do you know what? I really am. I've been doing some dirty paws. Oh, yeah. Have you now? I enjoy that. I'm going to do. I'm going to do some more dirty paws. It's it's brilliant. I'm not actually, talking about Millie, my it? dog, either. No. Um, <laughs> oh, I do. I do love it. I've done. I've done two canvases. One's on the wall already. Oh, and wow. the other one, I just need to get a back frame for, and that's going on the wall. 
I'm just gonna, uh, this is annoying me, this bit here. That's a good thing about using glue. It takes a few minutes to set, so I think we're gonna pull this out a fraction. And then when that dries, if you see any wrinkles, it will come out there. That's lovely. And then if you want, you can do some, I've done some faux stitching around the outside, just with the normal, normal pen. Um, there we go. That's, oh, look at that. That's one done. That so that's is a nice lovely. page for your journal. So I'm going to turn it around to, to here so you can have a nice close up of it. There you go. That's, I'm still trying to get the red liner tape off that glue. Um, <laughs> that is fabulous. Isn't that gorgeous? Again, what a lovely card for somebody, but also home decoration as well. And you have that lovely satisfaction of doing that. Right, let's have a look at your one-day special. My word, we have been busy, busy, busy. The price is incredible, don't you think? £17.97. You get your magazine full of inspiration full of wonderful things to read and 69 projects in there. We've also got your two stamps that are exclusive to you guys buying this. You can't get those stamps anywhere else. They're exclusive to the magazine. This is issue number two. Issue number one, you can't get any more. This is issue number two, so get this whilst you can. More items for you. You've got your embossing folder there. What a beautiful embossed folder with those flowers. You've got your stencil as well. You've got your different little projects on there. And you've got that gorgeous moth. That is incredible. The detail that you get when you cut out that moth, while well, it's second to none, it really is. It's absolutely stunning. Uh, you've also got your A4 set of stamps. So, wow, yeah, they are big stamps. You've got some great detail in there with that lady with the flowers in the hair. You've got the balloon in there. You've got that beautiful floral display. You've got some sentiments in there as well. You've got that postage stamp. All kinds of stamps to use within your mixed media projects are going to look absolutely stunning and fantastic. You've also got the papers as well. They're inside your magazine. So those papers are going to help you create beautiful cards, beautiful tags, fantastic wall decorations as well you can follow the projects that are in the magazine but you can also go a little bit rogue and do your own uh, projects with the papers that are included let me just show you some of the projects in the magazine itself let's open this one up so you've got step-by-step -step guide to your projects holding that up so you can see there that particular design has been made and doesn't it look stunning when you actually see it right there and that's your sepia skies and that's by caroline uh, we've then got another project by joe rice the wonderful joe rice i mean this is incredible if i just show you that on top of that card so again step by step it'll tell you all about the materials that you need all about how to put this together and the great thing is you make it once you can make it again and again and again Again, because you've got that tuition in there in the magazine if you want to get hold of it I would pop it into your basket and check out right now because 60% of the stock has gone 731572 this is the extended stock we sold out of the one day special in six minutes in the earlier show uh, but we have got a huge stock for you but 60% of the stock has gone remember this is on repeats overnight and people can watch it again on rewind available on their smartphones their tablets and their computers so they might be having a lunch hour working throughout the night they'll be able to watch the show again and then order right that's your one day special let's head back to Kay we've got another demonstration coming up for you right so um, I've um, picked her out of the um, I said the papers there I think she's gorgeous and uh, I'm just going to do quite a quick demo now I was going to do it just on watercolor card but I think I'm going to change my mind and do it on the patterned card for you then it makes it a bit quicker a bit easier for you then you don't have to panic and I'm just going to do a really really simple technique using some of our translucent paints so I've got ugly duckling on here which is this lovely translucent brown and um, I've got some racing green on there just spread it out on your um, mat, and your I think paint they're mat. both in the same bundle as well they of your are. luscious pigments. Yes. Uh, don't underestimate oh, this brown paint, because sorry. this is a good colour to actually tone down any bright colours if you want a different tone to them. So all I'm going to do is use a credit card, okay, or an old store card, whatever, one that you're not using, <laughs> okay, and I'm just going to do some lines. 
down here. OK, this isn't quite as quick as the, the card that I, um, the page that I did uh, on the six o'clock one. They said, you've got five minutes to do one, and I did it in two. <laughs> did you? <laughs> I did, <laughs> to, to even my surprise, to be honest. <laughs> you know, I do like picking up objects that are around me to use in paint like this. And it's fascinating, the results that you can get. It's one of my favourite tools, yeah. actually. It really is. I seem to use it all the time, and I just love it. And I've got a collection here of um, articles <laughs> that I use for making circles yeah. as well. Um, so, yeah, it's, um, it's, I've got a box of stuff like that. Which I is often use the, the base of a, a certain brand of cheesecake that comes in a little ramekin. And I've yes. got so many of those. I it's, know. A bit, it's a bit gooey. It, it is a bit gooey. Yeah. And um, they're fantastic. Oh, aren't they're they? brilliant. <gasps> they I are. I love the brilliant. millionaires. Oh, 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 oh. well, not any longer because I'm, you know, I'm on a diet. So, um, yeah, well, not any longer. Little, but you know what they say, Kay? Little and often. Well, actually, yeah, Ella said that to me on Saturday, and I, I had some of my mum's apple crumble and custard. <gasps> oh, Kay. Oh. Oh, it I was. love a bit of custard. In fact, oh, I was, was talking. Amazing. I was talking to my good friend Pepper in a penny today, saying that with her cupcake, she should have little powdered custard to go with it. Yes. Yeah, definitely. Oh, I like oh, a bit of custard in the cupcakes. Oh yeah, custard. Yeah, my daughter loves a custard donut. I like a Portuguese tart. Oh, that's Alfie's favourite. Is it? It the, is. They've gone up in price. Have they? Portuguese tart, Cheeky. well pricey now. I think they've gone up up, up in price because they call, call them Portuguese tarts. <laughs> it's a little, little, little. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, but they are. I, I was only introduced to them last year, and now I love them. They're gorgeous, aren't they? So I'm just going to mix that ugly duckling in with the green, and you'll see how that just affects the colour, and it just tones it down so it's not quite as bright. So can you see how I'm just doing Love odd it. It's like a designer paper. It's fabulous. That's right, isn't it? It's yeah. Almost like a wood effect or a bamboo effect yeah. that you're creating. I love that. And the lovely thing is that this doesn't stamp perfectly, so you get sort of, you know, different shaped lines and it's not perfect. That's what I like about it. And also because you're using something like this you can't be too uh, precious about it you know you can't really use a pair of tweezers with uh, with mixed media but phil martin can actually you know can't he so yeah if phil can do it if phil can do it anyone can do anyone it anyone can do it we might <laughs> let him out again from his cupboard do you know where he's cupboard here no, I don't. Yeah, yeah, he's, he's always here. He never goes home, you know. He's locked away in a little cupboard. <laughs> Where's he, he emailed it, uh, uh, emailed us earlier from he the cupboard. He had, a, he had a signal, 4G. <laughs> um, he's not connected to the Wi-Fi, no. No, because he'd, he'd overuse it. He'd overuse it if we let him connect to the Wi-Fi. <laughs> we don't want that. Uh, we've got a minute left. OK, all right. I'm, I'm nearly there. I'm nearly there. Right, so now I've added some white gesso. OK, so let's just mix that in. And then you can just carry on with this for as long as you like, really. Just building it up or not, or just... Do you know what that reminds me of? Almost like uh, rain on a window. It's beautiful. It's, it's lovely, isn't it, mm. how um, it, just, it just builds up? That's stunning. Okay, absolutely stunning. 40 seconds left of the show. That's fine. So there we go. That one on top of that one. Done. Wow. Do you know, I kind of liked it half cocked. I think that was nice. Yeah. Yeah, just sort of <laughs> slanted to a the bit, side there. A bit, a bit, bit on the wonk. Yeah, a little bit on the wonk. Okay. I like that. I'll leave yes, it on the wonk. You see? There you go. Happy accident. <laughs> okay, thank you so much. I'm going to see you tomorrow. Yes. Have a good night. Thank uh, you. you guys do check out your baskets. Seriously, thank we've been everyone. so, so busy. And uh, Kay says thank you very much. So, uh, check out your baskets. Make sure you get it. Uh, and we're going to come back after the break. <laughs>